What's up, everybody? I'll mute sounds for now so you're just not hearing PvPing this whole time. Can you guys hear me? Is my mic working and fine? Is my mic. I changed a bunch of uh, settings today on my stream stuff. Let me know if anything is too loud. If my mic's too loud, if the in game sounds too loud, if the music's too loud. I tried to set up my stream to. Uh, to be a little bit more efficient and like not pick up discord voice and stuff so i don't know if i broke anything did you get blade after the buff i do not have blade yet nope it has not dropped for me yet loud stream to uh i was just trying to see if my mic was working Just waiting for a raid to start. We should be starting in about 30 minutes. Hey, what's up, Christopher? How you doing, bro? Just started the, the stream a little bit before, right? Did you get your dagger? Nah, I did not. Still using Glimmering Gizmo Blade. Still using that Gizmo Blade. You have two freezing bands now? Damn, dude. That's awesome. Think that's worth or not? What do you mean by worth? Like, are you selling them? They'll definitely sell. Freezing band will definitely sell.
Are they good? Um, they're okay. They're okay. Like... Maybe they would sell 21 Frost damage. I mean, that's a pretty big deal. If, you're, if, if Frost becomes, like, super meta and super popular, which it might, it might end up rock crease piking in price. I could see a mage wanting to use two of those, though. 21 Frost damage. For PvE... And, well, yeah, it's obviously good in P... Like, sorry. But people know that item for is for PvP. Like, uh, it's a really good PvP trinket, like, in certain situations. Like, I know Feral Druids like to troll with it and stuff. Uh, but it's fun for PvP, though. But now that Frost is popping off, and it's not unique, maybe a Frost Mage uses two of them. Guess I should make some water. I'm assuming I'm gonna have to shell some out. I did not get my dagger. No. I did not get my dagger. Yeah, I could see it being best for Frost, Chris. If you have two of those, I would maybe hold on to them for like a week. See what happens. Because like Frost is starting to pop off now. And people are starting to catch on to how good it is. I'm also making a Frost DPS parse guide this week. So that'll also probably help a bit. So if you wait like a week... Chris, if you don't plan on playing Frost, you might be able to sell those for a lot. But if you're planning on playing Frost, it could be possible that's Biss for you. I'm gonna guess it's Biss. I'm assuming you would use two of that ring if you're Frost, so I would guess it's Biss. That would make sense to me, Chris. I have literally done, like, very little research on Frost DPS, so I, I I can't, like, even pretend to tell you if it's Biss, but I would assume it's Biss. 21 damage is a lot, so... Shit, maybe I gotta get fucking two of them. You got both for 600 gold? Shit, man. Hell yeah. Uh... Hell yeah, Michael, Michelle, Mikiel. I don't know how to say your name, but you know who I'm talking to. Mr. Delu. Congrats, bro. Um, if I'm maining Frost DPS, I'll probably put Frost damage on it, but maybe Int. Maybe Int because I use it in all farms, so... If you are the only mage DPS, it is better for you to be fire. Is what the old sim said. That might change over time once Frost gets more popular and people figure it out more, but... Old sim said that if you are a solo mage, you want to be fire spec playing Balefire Bolt. Hopefully I don't blow it with this raid, though. I'm looking to get some really good parses here.
Yeah, I'm gonna play Living Bomb. Ice Science is definitely not worth it. Yeah, it's such a shame we can't enter a lot of the higher level dungeons. A lot of cool stuff we'd be doing. Um, even in PvP, like, li like 1v1 duels, maybe you can make an argument for Ice Lance, but... I don't think so. Even in PvP, I would use Living Bomb. Like, Ice Lance fucking sucks compared to Living Bomb. Like, Living Bomb is just so good. Even in, like, a 1v1 duel, I would assume I would want to use Living Bomb instead of Ice Lance. I'm fully consumed up, boys. I am fully consumed up. Got Songflower and the World buff. No DMF, of course, because didn't get it because it's not out. Um, I got NP5 scrolls. I've got crit scrolls. I got two of the flask. Plenty of superior mana potions. Plenty of lips. Got Elixirs of Firepower. Um, these will probably be useless for me. Um, the only thing it will buff is probably a Fire Blast if I ever... Or in Living Bomb, obviously. Uh, so it's not useless. I forgot I'm running Living Bomb. So, no, it's not useless. It only buffs Living Bomb. Um, most of my other spells will be buffed by Frost Power, though. Um, I got one of the... Um, buff the Flask from that stupid thingy. In Blasted Lands, 25 Intellect. I got 10 Arcane Elixir, Greater Arcane Elixir Potion, so 35 spell damage. Got some Nature Protection Pots, Free Action Pots. Um, I got Nightfin Soup for the NP5. Jungle Durian for Speed Drinking. So for Frost Fire Bolt, fire, fire Power would not buff my Frost Fire Bolt. Because Frost Power gives it more. The Elixir of Frost Power gives 15 Frost Damage. And the Elixir of Fire Power gives 10. And Frost Fire Bolt scales off of your highest coefficient. Not both. Yeah, it does not double dip. It does not double dip. So Frost Fire Bolt would only... In this situation, since I don't have any other fire damage, it would um, benefit from my Frost Power or Elixir. I mean, yes, insert, if you need, like, if you're playing a, it depends on the clash you're 1v1ing, Jared. If it's a clash you need to constantly reset versus, then, you know, it's not ideal. But in burst phase, like, you wouldn't open with Living Bomb. I don't know, I could see plenty of 1v1s where, like, you wouldn't open with Living Bomb. You would wait till you need to reset, but. I, I, I could see, like, yes, an argument for not using Living Bomb in 1v1s, but its burst damage is so good that. I at least would not be running Ice Lance because I would not want to be wasting the Fingers of Frox, Frox on anything but Deep Freeze, personally. Especially if you're running... It depends on what you're running um, for this slot. I know a lot of people run Frost Fire Bolt in PvP, so, like, if I had Deep... If I had uh, Fingers of Frost up, my plan would be Sheep, um, uh, Frost Fire Bolt, Frost Fire Bolt, Deep Freeze, the batch of Deep Freeze, and then that's, like, almost all their HP right there. So you really only need one reset, so... You wouldn't even need Living Bomb for that kill, I guess. But Ice Lance sucks, man. Ice Lance is just so bad. Maybe you take Rewind Time for 1v1s. If you're running a regen. But I don't know if you're going to be running regen... Oh, you wouldn't be running regen if you're running deep... Yeah, you wouldn't be running regen. You need Fingers of Frost or Deep Freeze unless you're just going to only rely on um, Nova's or... Uh, 
whatever this shit's called, Frostbite. I don't know, you can make an argument for both. But yeah, I guess, if you're if you're looking to reset, yes. Living Bomb would be a detriment to that, but... No, dude, I have not done STV at all. I, like, any time I'm playing this game, I'm in Mara. I have not done a single start STV yet. But by the time I do the next raid, I'll have the epic Frost Ring. But right now, I don't. Yeah, Jared. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. You would it and uh, it, you would only be using it for batching, which is so fun. That's the only situation you're supposed to use deep freeze and raid is when you're batching your second proc um, with a frost firebolt. I'm glad you like it, Jordan. And then, yeah, for runes today, Deep Freeze, Fingers of Frost. Now, some people make the argument for not running Deep Freeze and you run Burnout instead, but currently, the Sims say that this spec has the potential to Sim higher, so. Deep Freeze, Fingers of Frost, Frost Firebolt, Icy Veins. Icy Veins is actually huge with this spec because of Cold Snap. Getting two Icy Veins is massive. It's worth using the GCD for the second Icy Veins. Like, it is a DPS increase. Spell Power, obviously. We run Molten Armor because we do not cast Fail Fire Bolt. We only cast Frost Fire Bolt. And then Living Bomb. And we do maintain Living Bomb on single targets. We do maintain Living Bomb on single target. All right, I had assignments. It looks like I'm Group 2 caster group. What was Group 2? Oh, this is a Group 3 left, Group 4 right, but I'm in Group 2. Would you use two freezing bands if you got them cheap? Probably. I would buy two freezing bands for like 300 gold each. I would not pay more than that. I don't think personally. Because if I were to go big on an item, it would be Eye of Flame. But you wouldn't run Eye of Flame when running um, double freezing bands. So. Can you send me the Mage Discord link? Sure, let me find it.
People say the drop rate's 2%, but we haven't had hard confirmation of that yet. Maybe I should go live like 15 minutes before start time. Maybe 30 minutes before start time is a little too long to have people just sitting here waiting. So maybe like 15 minutes before start time next time. What are you talking about in terms of payments, Jacob? Like, how do you receive the payments? Or like, in terms of money? Like, uh, in terms of like, um, money per hour or whatever you want to say. I don't know. Like, what what, what are you referring to, Jacob? 8.5% crit chance? Well, I'm not buffed. I don't have a... Uh... Well, also, my gear is just kind of shit, but I don't have molten armor on. I don't think I have much crit on my gear at all. I think it's just my chest piece and my belt. I think my only crit's from my chest and my belt. Belt. And chest. Oh, it's shoulders, so I got 3% from that. From gear. Yeah. Thanks, Reming. I hope to get it soon, too, bro, bro. I hope to get it soon, too. Oh yeah, I'm also not running Burnout, correct. I'm running Fingers of Frost. For this raid, I am running Fingers of Frost. Maybe we'll run Burnout for future raids. Right now, the Sims say Fingers of Frost Sims better, though. Alright, I think I've set up my stream to where you guys won't be hearing Discord. So if things get a little awkward to where I'm not like talking to you guys or you hear me talk to someone else or something, it's because I'm in Discord. I'm 99% sure it's set up to where you won't hear them though. Um, and I should be able to talk to you guys just fine, but I'll also be listening to Discord. So, um, you know, if you see me distracted or not focusing on chat, it's because Discord's also going on. I'll unmute disc when we're getting closer to starting, but... Oh, let me go ahead and make my jades. I haven't made those yet. Look at all these consumes, boys. And I'm going to have to get a consume tracker, because I know I'm going to forget to rebuff certain consumes. I know it. Hey, what's up, Shot? Shoptastica. Thanks for stopping by, man. Just to confirm, you guys can't hear Discord, right, boys? I never tested it, but I was just messing around with stream settings while I was offline. And I think I set it up to where you guys can't hear disc. Why don't I use the Blasted Land flag? Oh, Christopher, thanks, dude. I, it doesn't stack with the Zanzas, right?
Good call. I'm just going to go ahead and delete it then. Oh, you guys hear Discord? Oh, you do guys, you guys do hear Discord, huh? That did not work at all then. Well, you guys do hear it. Okay, I guess it didn't work. I'll have to try and figure that out tomorrow. Oh, you guys don't hear it? Oh, you got, I got trolled? Okay, lol. <laughs> okay. None of the, no one's trading me for water either, so. Frost popping off? It seems to be doing well, man. No, we can't hear it. Okay, thanks. <laughs> Lol. Uh, he, he, you got me good there, Rushy. You got me good there, man. I believed you. Streamer brain. Yeah, I know that water, Kaliskis. I've got better water. The Argent Dawn water is 4,400 mana. This water is 6,600 mana. I use the good water. I made this bum water for my raid. Oh, my bags were full. That's why I didn't make any of my citrines. Shit. Look at this fucking bum. This is my first raid as Frost. No, it's from the new ZG Flask. Yeah, here's the talents. It's Ice Fairy and Winter's Chill at the bottom. No, this is my first time raiding as Frost. Probably in the history of WoW. Well, oh, I guess I've raided as Frost in Molten Core, so never mind.
I hate buffing so much. Sorry guys, I was talking to the other mage in the raid. This is our first time interacting with each other, so I was just letting him know it was winter's chill, and he was like, we're, we're just yeah, doing the mage discussion that needs to happen around that, so. Sorry I was silenced there and just typing. Alright, we got our knife. I don't know if we're about to start going, but I want to get unbuffed. It's, um, the water is from, so those new Atal flasks that you turn in at the ZG Island that give you these, one of the other options he has is to turn in one of those flasks for a stack of this food, the jungle durian. So you have to turn in those flasks for the food. I don't know, Bo. I haven't done SM, so I can't tell you for sure. So the reason I don't think they're going to fix the ZG farm, Jacob, is because Sunken Temple trash doesn't work that way. It seems like it's only for dungeons. I actually don't need how much hit you need. I don't know how much hit you need, but I assume with elemental precision, we have enough. 
I don't know the exact number. I am new to Frost, and I kind of just threw this rate like to get this together over the last couple hours. I didn't look at every single detail. You get all the hit you need from Tyler. That's what I thought, Weasel. That's what I thought. Sorry, guys. We're waiting on two dinguses who weren't here on time, and because of the horde, we weren't able to summon them, so... We're waiting on that. Oh, 5%. Did you do the Sunken Temple trash farm? Yeah, I did it. Okay, let me get all my buffs out, then. I think I've got every buff. I don't think I'm missing one, so here we go. What was my level route for Z phase four? I did pre-questing and then ZF the whole way. I need to get a Fingers of Frost proc so I confirm my weak aura is still tracking it. I guess I don't need a Living Bomb those mobs, they die so fast. Did I pop my Frost Power? I don't know which one of these buffs would be it. Maybe I didn't? I did not prop Frost Power. I knew I was missing some. I knew I didn't click one of them. It was Frost Power. Come on, I need a single Frost. Fro uh, yeah, fingers of Frost proc. So I can confirm my weak aura is tracking it correctly. Oh, it is. Cool. Let's see if we can get the batch deep freeze. We did. Cool. Hell yeah, Benjamin. Grats, bro. Yeah, I'm noticing a lot more mana back from the Paladins, for sure. 
The Paladin change is noticeable. I'm still like ooming, like spam arcane explosioning, but I am a. Uh, it is very noticeable. I haven't unboomed as well. I knew I was. Like, there was something I was like, what if I had not done? I need to remember to unboom before the first boss. I need out of combat and full drink. No, I'm gonna get a hundreds of frost tonight. I'll replace those RK 99s. Now, what he's saying is because I got 99s as arcane, if I get like a 98, my default will show my highest part. So, he's, that's what he meant. Get the batch deep freeze here. We're just practicing it. It does no damage on trash mobs. It only does damage to the bosses. Right? Is that how it works? Yeah. They gotta be permanently immune to stun. Is Frost better than Fire? It's comparable right now. It's comparable, David. It could become better. We don't know. But right now, it looks like Fire's still slightly better overall. But Frost might catch it. We don't know. What the hell is that timer for? The dagger drop? No, I never got the dagger. I never got the dagger, my fan. Tomorrow I will get it. Or depending on how I feel after the raid, I might go stream some Maras. Like maybe after uh, this sunken temple, I might do one or two, but I might be too tired. It depends on when this raid ends. We'll see. Oh, right. I wanted to capture footage locally. Do I have enough hard drive space to record this raid? I do. Okay. Start recording. I'm recording the raid because I want to make a frost guide out of this. Uh, Dank, t Dank Tank TV. Thanks for the Twitch Prime sub, bro. I appreciate you, fam. I mean, the Emerald Gear is nice if you don't have better Dank Tank, but 
I don't know, that grind fucking sucks, so I would not force people to do it. If you do not have, like, Gnomer gear, then yes, that gear would be nice farming it. I think 154, Bjorn. I think 154 is what I was at. Gnomer gear is really good, dude. Shit, some of the Gnomer gear is comparable to Sunken Temple gear. Like, that's how overpowered Gnomer loot was. Nah, oh, I'm unbooting right away. Half the raid jumped and didn't kill this mob. <laughs> yeah, d yeah. It's a rough phase, Dank Tank. It's a rough phase. Ooh, don't die, don't die, don't die. Alright, none of my buffs need to be refreshed right now. Alright, I am unboomed. I am ready to go. Yeah, I have three piece irradiated, but I died the first week wearing it, so I'm just not wearing irradiated anymore. I need to see what my assignment was. Group three left. Is group three going left as we face the boss? Uh, where's my mana food? What's it at? It keeps getting removed by something. Is is it? Does Nightfin not stack with something? What is it getting replaced? By? Oh, it's right there. I'm at six minutes on it. Okay, I don't need to refresh it. Got the dagger yet? No, James, I have not. Gotcha, Kelthor. Yeah, I mean, if I was truly min maxing, that's what I would be doing. I'm taking this first raid simple. I guess since I'm ice barrier, I could get away with it though. They do. I mean, I think they do. Maybe they don't. Maybe it's just a waste of gold. I don't fucking know. Okay, I'm going to precast Arp. I hope. I wonder how close I can get to cast precast Frost Firebolt. Can I get close enough? Shit, I wasted my fucking, uh, blink. I should have saved that. I'm not happy with how I pulled this parse off. Didn't get a single, f uh, fingers of frost proc either.
I'm Frost Firebolt. I'm Frost Spec. I'm not uh, Scorch Spec. Uh, I need to see the logs, though. Are we live logging? Let me see if I can find the logs. I want to see what I did. Oh, I only got an 81. Ew, gross parts. Yeah, I, got, I, I, I played that so bad, though. For sure. For sure. Yeah, I misplayed that fight. So I, I understand. Maybe you run Burnout there instead of Fingers of Frost because the fight's so short. Because I didn't get a single Fingers of Frost proc there. I think I'm just going to run Burnout. You know what? Fuck it. I'm just going to take off Fingers of Frost and run Burnout. I'm just going to try Burnout. Because that was annoying not getting a single Fingers of Frost proc. And I hate that kind of RNG. I hate that kind of RNG. Oh, I got one proc? Okay, I just didn't notice it then. I gotta fix my weak aura. If I, did, if I got one proc, I don't think that would have changed my parse all that much. But I, if I miss a park, I just suck. I gotta make my weak aura bigger. Yeah, but what else? Like, what? what's the point of even um, the hell? Like, I don't need art at warding. I'm not gonna mana shield ever. So, you're right though. There's no point running deep freeze. I'm going to try burn out this fight, see if I like the extra crit more, but obviously I fucking blew that first fight. No more cluck? Nah, we disbanded. We disbanded. You get Blade of Eternal Darkness grind after this? I don't know yet. It depends on how this raid goes. Oh, the proc was during that blink in the stone bit? Yeah, and that's the part where I fucked up the pool. All right, maybe I commit to maybe I commit to fingers of frost one more time. But part of me feels like I should give up on it just because I'm so distracted right now on being a shitter. But we'll, we'll do fingers of frost another pool. Busy mental mentally, yeah, no, it's it's not the best excuse though. I definitely misplayed so. I'm going back to fingers of frost and I'll try it on this next fight to see how it foils. Yeah, people said they increased the drop chance. It seems like it based off how many have gotten it, but I haven't gotten it yet. Look at how our tanks are topping damage on this pool. Paladins do so much AoE damage, it's crazy. The top two DPS on this pool are two prop paladins, and then third is me. <laughs> Fucking nuts. Um, I don't see my night fin, so I'm gonna night fin. Yep, new night fin. Get full mana. Shaman tank DPS does insane on trash too. Oh yeah, you're saying the same ghost. That's crazy. All right, he said hug the right, so. Oh no, this debuff. I didn't pass for Icy Veins on pull either. I'm like blowing my rotation. 
I should have had Ice Barrier up to prevent the knockback either as well. Like, I fucked this pull up so hard. I don't have Ice- I don't have Cold Snap, so I couldn't Cold Snap Icy Veins. Oh, right, we got one Fingers of Frost proc. We're gonna Deep Freeze this one. Okay. I have no deep freeze for this one. I don't know why I blinked there. I should have just pumped. I don't know why I blinked there. I should have just pumped. I don't know why I blinked there. I should have just gone for an extra cast. I tried to reposition for some reason. I definitely blew that fight. I definitely, uh, I'm gonna check the parse, and it's going to be bad. An 81 again? Oh, did, no, the, the update didn't update. Uh, 88 on that one, so that was better than the 81, but yeah. I'm fucking blowing it. I'm trying to track too many things, because I'm semi-new to doing this. Um. I, just part of me wants to just go burnout, just to remove the complication of it. So I think I'm just gonna I'm just gonna run. I'm gonna run burnout for the rest of the raid. Just as just because of my first time raiding S Frost and I am just fucking everything up. I just feel like I really just blew everything there. Any phase three runes you should grab for Sunken Temple? Molten Armor. Absolutely molten armor. Lamar's fire. He's playing fire, and I'm his winner's chill, bitch. Oh, yeah. No, I fucked up that fight bad. I blew that fight so bad. I could have done way more DPS, but I was, like, poorly blinking and stuff. Um, I was, like, looking at fucking for fingers of frost procs the whole time. But, yeah. Which is the idiot I have to interrupt, Haku? And you probably don't want a living bomb too much on this fight for the A of E. Let me see what the mage's gear like. I don't know anything about Lamar's gear. Yep, he's running three-piece irradiated. Yeah, his gear's like basically phase three abyss. Oh, he's got the cord at least. That belt's huge. Oh, no, it's not. Never mind. That's, I thought it was a different belt. Oh, yeah, I don't have my tailoring shoulders yet, but I'm on the quest for it. So I should have my tailoring shoulders tonight if I do the quest, the rest of the quest chain. Oh, he's got a Devastate Warrior, and he's doing good damage. I, forgot, I saw that Devastate was potentially pumping, but yeah. In a Tude Mage comp, right now it looks like Fire out DPS's Frost, just barely. But they're very close. Oh yeah, he's definitely getting a huge boost from me. Winter's Chill's big for him. He definitely loves it. I don't love how I'm playing. The spec's not the issue, I'm the issue. I'm the one that's not... The reason I have all 80 parses right now, which obviously isn't awful, purple parsing's good, but... I should be getting 95s if I was playing this right. 
Did you end up getting the dagger? I did not. I did not end up getting the dagger. Oh, my music stopped playing. Sorry, guys. Are we going? Okay, we are pure. Frost. Fire, bolt, spamming. I'm gonna save Icy Veins for the next fight though, I think. Oh, I'm pumping this one though. That chain lightning. Watch your step. That guy charged me. I interrupted that. Attack taken. Phase change. I thought about cold snapping here, but I want to save it for the next fight. I'm trialing with a new guild, so this is a guild run. Can I get one more Frostfire Bolt off? Doesn't look like it. Phase change. Wow, mana is just not an issue anymore. Oh, Gasher on me. Oh my god, I interrupted my Frost Fireball. Got the interrupt on that bitch. I keep almost I, I keep almost cold snapping out of instinct to get that second um, Icy Veins off, but um, I stopped myself. Can I get the last Frost Fireball off? Nope. Should have Fire Blasted. Okay, let's see how I did on that parse. I feel like that one should be better. Atali Defenders, rankings. I got 92 that one, so we made our ways in the 90s for that fight. And that was without Cold Snap, so we're getting a little bit better. Obviously, I'm not focused on Fingers of Frost right now, so that helped my focus a bit. Drop out of cluck. That was my guild, and we disbanded. We had a lot of people quit, and we couldn't recover, so... Most of us that were remaining are in this guild. Like, Jaku's here, Arano is here, Darbs is here, um, Z Fat Zack and um, Tim Allen are um, in the guild, but they don't have a raid spot yet. Um, but everyone else quit the game, or left, so... Frostfire Bolt is insanely OP. It's scale, it's like, it's the reason why Arcane is dead, because Frostfire Bolt just does so much damage compared to every other spell Mage has. Like, Frostfire Bolt scaling is busted. It is so good. Oh, shit. I gotta rebuff. 30 minute buffs. I'm not gonna get time for my, uh, weapon oil. Oh, I might, I might, I might. I think I got my full buffs off. Four. Yep, full buffs off. Sweet. One. Oh, why would you do this mid-fight? I already rolled need. God damn it. And Arano didn't PI beyond pool because he's silly. God damn it, Arano. Let's 
second icy vein. Need to get a new living llama. I don't remember which one we're killing first. Weaver, I think. Someone got knocked. Wow, mana is just not an issue anymore with this buff. Why aren't we stacking them for cleave, though? That's what I don't know. Oh, no! Woo! I almost fucked that, boys. Did y'all see that? Man, I, I, I definitely did not handle this parse well. I de and I, I definitely can do better. But... Oh, he, he fucking PI'd me at the end of the fight! He PI'd me now! They, uh, they made the mana from Seal of Martyrdom better. No, 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 that wasn't luck, guys. That was me calculating the distance from the hole perfectly. You guys don't understand the skills. You guys, hey, you guys just don't understand, don't you? I see my parse. Probably not good. 83. Yeah, I am blowing it, boys. I am blowing it. Yeah, the mana buff for um, Seal of Martyrdom, though. It's super noticeable. Oh, I know PI doesn't count the parse. I know. But it just in terms of doing raw DPS, you know, it helps. It kills. It does count toward the parse in the sense that it makes the boss die faster, technically, right? But yes. I wouldn't. I mean, that would be great, Minty. Yeah, I don't need a mana pots anymore. I haven't used a single one today. I've only used my agate. Oh, I'm just glad I didn't die. Yeah, things like PI get, um, sorted out of parses. He's a fire mage, and he's getting winter chills from his frost mage. That's what he's doing. I 
I need to remember to pre-pop ice. Of course, or... Damn. Two world buff losses. To Ghost. Yeah, but Fire already does a lot of damage. Yes. I get the Scorch from him. So there is obviously a, a individual trade-off there, but yeah. Fixed title? What does the title say? It says Frostmage Winter... Frostmage Sunken Temple, right? What do you mean fixed title? What are you talking about? How is this clickbait? I'm rating as Frost. What are you talking about, Willis? Not you, the other ghost. The ghost that killed our raiders. Ryan, you're gonna die to him again. Ryan has died twice to ghosts now. You are embarrassing me in front of my new guild. And I keep having to rebuff your dumb ass. So stop it. Oh yeah, Arcane's dead, dude. Arcane is dead as fuck. I'm not running Fingers of Frost right now, no. I was getting too distracted by it and fucking it up too much. I'm just running Burnout right now to make it simple for me. Because uh, I'm just blowing this raid. I'm not playing Brain Freeze. I'm playing Deep Frost, Frost Firebolt. The other mage, Lamar, is fire. I was talking about him. I'm not playing Brain Freeze, though. Brain Freeze sucks. Don't play Brain Freeze. I meant this is like the first raid of the phase I've streamed. Not that I was the number one mage. Silly is that. Oh, oh. I almost got a run -ode. I am Frostbeck, though. But the Sims? Fro Frost Sims, good. What do you mean? You shouldn't be running bra Brain Freeze. If you're running any spec that's not what I'm doing, you're running Fingers of Frost with Deep Freeze. You're not running Brain Freeze. Yeah, there's a lot that I to figure out about the frost spec for sure. I am running deep freeze for the first half, but I was fucking up Nils SBS. Um, I'll swap back to it for this fight though. Fuck it. You know what? As soon as I'm out of combat. Oh, we are out of combat. Okay. Wait, nope, not yet. Got to get out of combat. From the ghost. <sighs> How am I on buffs? Alright. We're back to Fingers of Frost. We're playing Fingers of Frost, Deep Freeze again this pool. We're gonna try it again. We're gonna try it again. Uh, we need a new Night Fin.
Is there a guide for it? No, but I'm probably making a Frost DPS guide sometime this week. I'm capturing the footage I need to make the guide right now, and then I'm going to like go over information in the Mage Discord, look through logs, write the script, hoping to have a Frost DPS guide out tomorrow, but there's a lot of question marks, so... So playstyle is you're framing, spamming Frost Firebolt. Frost Firebolt stacks Winter Chill. Winter's Chill buffs both your Fire and Frost Mage since they both use Frost Firebolt. That's the main goal is get Frost Firebolt stacks. Um, Sims and Log show the top Frost DPS. Um, is maintaining Living Bomb on single target fights. They will live. They will living bomb. Um. I don't know if you're about. Sorry. Arano is one of my friends, and we're trialing with this guild right now, and he has died three times a ghost. I don't know if Arano's getting a raid spot, <laughs> because he's living a he's leaving an interesting uh, impression. <laughs> uh, sorry, I got distracted there. So yeah, the rotation is Fingers of Frost. Um, you're spamming Frost Fire Bolts. When you get a Fingers of Frost proc, you want to use Deep Freeze on the second one with a Batched Frost Fire Bolt. Um, it's just extra DPS. It does damage instead of a stun. I saw a couple of high DPS Frost Mages that weren't using, um... Deep Freeze, but most use Deep Freeze. Don't know exactly which one's going to end up being the better one, but... Which one's the one we kill? Jamal? I forget. Doesn't it change which week you kill? Which one you kill? I don't know who we're on, no one's saying, and I forget, so. He's killing Jamal. I'm gonna... Oh, I didn't precast frickin' Frost Firebolt because I'm trash. Ryan, P.I. me, you fool! Oh, we're swapping to Ogham. We swapped to Ogham. Okay, we got our first... Oh, nope, my Fingers of Frost got instantly consumed by um, Living Bomb. That's why I didn't get my proc off there. Okay, get the Batch Deep Freeze. Boom, Batch Deep Freeze. Thank 
God damn it. I'm like having no mana issues. This is fucking crazy. Watch your step. Ugh, that hurts. I haven't gotten a Fingers of Frost proc in a while. There's one. Alright, we're gonna batch this Deep Freeze, then Living Bomb. Woo, big crits. Oh, I hate that pennant's knockback. I should ice barrier before it. Nice. I feel like I did really good damage there. I outdid. I don't know if I'm rolling on hubris because I'm going for blade. I'll just greed roll hubris. I got a 98 parse there, boys. I got a 98 on that one. I got a 98 on that one. That one we did good. We finally we got a good parse there, boys. We finally got a good parse as Frost. 98. We'll take it. We'll take it. I rolled greed on the dagger. I let someone else get it because I'm not going to use it long term. I'm going to get Blade of Eternal Darkness long term, so why would I take that dagger, you know? Yeah, mana is not an issue at all. Uh, I mean, it's not my base. Someone else will use it. Whatever, you know? I'm going to have Blade... Dude, I'm getting Blade soon, so, you know, I don't need it. And this Holy Paladin took it, so what else? Did it replace my Arcane Parse? Let me check. As my best parse for that fight, Living Flame, Kalsorak. No, it still shows my Arcane parse ahead of it. My Arcane parse is still ahead of that one. Alright, I'm just finally getting into the rhythm of it, I feel. I wasn't doing good on uh, the other bosses, but that one felt better for sure. You think Blizzard have blocked my count from getting a blade? I hope not, man. Oh, none of these living bombs are going off, lol. Well, yeah, I'm doing less DPS, but I'm buffing the other mage. Like, Winter's Chill is so good. Yeah. It does proc off rune abilities. It gets, you get procs off of Living Bomb. We have confirmation it procs off of uh, Living Bomb. Yeah, Grisby no longer requires uh, anything. Yep. Ooh, this is a big-ass pull. I don't want to put Living Bomb on non-elite, so... Okay. Two bosses left.
Only one frost. If you have two or more mages. Two or more mages. One should be frost and the rest are fire. That is what current sims say. Don't know if that'll change in a week or two, but current sims say if you have more than two mages, it is better raid DPS overall for one to be fire and one to be frost. Or at least one to be fire and one to be frost. And if you have multiple mages, all the other mages should be fire. You should not stack frost mages based off of current sims. Oh, wait, I forgot these fuckers. Did I complete my quest? I did. Sweet. So I got my profession quest. I can make my shoulders after raid. Nice. Oh, right, we're saving cooldowns for that down phase. What rune do you got on my boots? Think spell power? Is that the rune? Yeah. Spell power, not brain freeze. Brain freeze sucks. Don't play brain freeze. Spell power. Any buffs I'm about to have fall. Oh, we're not doing the parse strat today, so I'm just popping cooldowns on pull then. They proc a lot? Nice. Yeah, I really want the shoulders, and I really want three-piece. Both three-piece and the shoulders are huge. Yeah, we're we're zooming this raid. This guild's doing well. I'm having I'm 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 I'm, uh, I'm happy with this, how this raid's performing. Five, four, three, two, one. Ryan, PI me if you're listening to my stream, Ryan. He didn't P.I. me. No fingers of frost procs, though. The proc rate is really annoying, that's for sure. I definitely get why some people want to run burnout. Alright, here we get the batch deep freeze. Oh, this is where we'd be doing the burn, gotcha. I wasted a cast by pre-casting elsewhere. So this is the thing where we're trying to one phase. They said we'd pop all cooldowns right here for a one phase. Alright, we get the next batch deep freeze. Oops. Let's get this batch deep freeze then. Popped a uh, ice barrier there. We lost a tank. Oh, are we about to wipe? Ooh, this might be a wipe. Uh, we got one proc of deep freeze, so we're gonna need the batch. Um... Damn, people are just not paying attention to mechanics. Number one damage, boys! Let's go! Frost, 1.7k. Look at that shit.
97 Pars ranked 67th in the world for that fight. 64th in the world as Frost for that fight. 64th. I hope I get that offhand. It said Frost damage. I hope I win that offhand. Do you guys see that? Hell yeah. Yeah, I pumped that fight, boys. I fucking pumped. Did I win the offhand? I did. Fuck yeah. Let's go, dudes. Frost damage, seven spell damage. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. Big gains, big gains. Yeah, I don't have any plus fire damage gear on me right now, but you're right. I have to prio fire, uh, frost damage now. Since I, um, like, obviously I wouldn't use living uh, Eye of Flame and shit with this, but yeah. I don't even have a frost damage ring on, so, or fire damage anything on. Um, fully rebuff myself. Can you show your talents? Yeah, just Deep Frost. What's the spell power for scaling on Frost Firebolt? I'm not sure, but it seems insane. Hits really fucking hard. And then the rest of the points are in fire. Oops, sorry, wrong spit. Impact Ignite. What's my crit fully buffed? 28%, but Winter's Chill gives me 10%, so 38%. Don't run Burnout, or I'd have, what is that, 53%? Fuck, Zare. Rip. Rip, rip, rip. You're right. Yep. Waste of 10 gold right there, man. Waste of 10 gold. You're right.
Arano has not PI'd me in like five bosses. Who's fucking it up? That guy. Oh no, I'm stunned. Fuck my butt. I fucked up. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die because I... Oh, maybe I won't die? I'm really fucking this fight up, I feel. Am I gonna die? I need an ice barrier. I'm like really low. Ooh, thanks for the heals, boys. I have no idea where we're stacked right now. I'm just gonna pump. God damn it. I just got I, I I just I just fucked this fuck up across the board three hundred times. I've done everything wrong with this fight. I got I I just I'm so embarrassed. Everyone stop watching. Turn your eyes off. Ooh, don't lose my world buffs like this. Don't lose my world buffs like this. I don't even want to look at my parse. I didn't lose my world buffs. Ooh, boy. Oh, Jake gets the bow, dude. Grats, Jake. I have not gotten the dagger, no. All right, boys. Let's see how embarrassingly that fucking parse went. Oh, I got an 83 still. I mean, that's not awful, but... Yeah, I just, like... I clowned that pool up all to hell. Sorry, my guild's talking right now. You guys can't hear it. I'm listening to them. I'll answer your guys' question whenever they're done talking.
Rotation is spam Frostfire Bolt. Um, maintain Living Bomb in most situations, even single target. When you get a Fingers of Frost proc, you cast Frostfire Bolt. Then you cast Frostfire Bolt again, and you spam Deep Freeze as that second Frostfire Bolt goes off. You'll do what's called Batching, and both the Frostfire Bolt and the Deep Freeze will benefit from that second proc of Fingers of Frost, if you batch it properly. Oh, I can't believe how I fucked that fight up, man. I'm glad it was still a purple parse. It did not feel like it was going to be a purple parse. Hundred percent of spell power. No wonder it's scaling so hard. That's getting a nerf for sure. I imagine. I'm running spell power. Alright, so here's me batch. Oh, nope, my living bomb and consumed it. Never mind. Damn, look at all the viewers I have watching me stream. That's so cool. Thanks for tuning in, everybody. I didn't know if you guys just liked my farming streams or if you would like the raid streams too, but cool. Glad so many people are watching. The raid's going well. I mean, we haven't wiped yet, and I still have my world buff, so... I consider that a dub, right? I mean, true. If we got nerfed, it would... Be... I mean, most of the nerfs they do are for PvP. So, like, if Frostfire Bolt starts one-shotting people in PvP... Uh... They would nerf it. Oh, gotcha. Oh, that's right. It, I forgot that's how the, the, the spell power coefficients work. It's targeting Arano. It's targeting Arano. Oh, no. Is this the most viewers I've had? No, I've had like five, six hundred before. This is the most viewers I've had while streaming a raid. My Noma raids were getting like 30 viewers, so. This is a lot in comparison. And I got like a good people. I got a lot of people on YouTube and I got people on Twitch watching too, so it's pretty cool. But not the most I've had, no. We don't know for sure, but it seems like it is. Thanks, Jagger. I'm glad you guys like my content, man. I still got my bus. It's my first time doing this boss, by the way. I have never done this boss before. None of my pugs have made it here. So I have no idea how I'm going to do. I'm probably going to blow it, though. <laughs> yeah, right? The it's one of the rare streams I'm not in Blade. Well, I'll be streaming all of my raids for the phase, but unfortunately it's only a weekly lockout, so only one of the streams of each week is going to be a raid. Obviously, once I get Boed, I'll stop streaming it. That'd be fucking, like... I can't wait to go to BRD, dude. And start learning shit. Now, 
That was my windows. Hell yeah, Hwangi. Congrats, dude. What's my spell power at? With all these buffs, I am at 424 frost damage. People think BRD is really not good right now because of the movement speed increases. I haven't gone to test, but so far I have not heard any good news about BRD. If anyone could have figured it out, it was probably Taiwan. He, I don't know if he's actually quit this phase or not, but he said he hated this phase and was AFK till phase 4 the other day. Um, but right now the best farms are Sunken Temple. Need a new night fin. I think I should be good otherwise. Let's hope we don't wipe so I can get this kill with my world buffs. Guild's going over strat, guys. Sorry. I gotta remember to pre-pop Ice Barrier because if I do take damage, the pushback prevention helps. I mean, ZF is just such a good gold farm in general, though, so, like, it's hard to beat that. I see people over here, so I'm coming over here. They said bring the blood behind the tank, which is over there, so I'm blinking right there, I guess. You only want to stack one of them, mage. Doesn't matter which you stack. Ideally, you want to stack frost because frost damage will buff deep freeze. Um, fire damage won't. So if you want to play frost, you probably want to stack frost damage. No one's got the egg. No one in our raid has the egg. We can't do the boss. Yeah, you got it, Ignite.
No one has the egg, so we can't summon the boss. That's so funny, dude. That's so funny. Oh, maybe someone's on the last part? Someone is on the last part, so they're gonna go turn it in. We are summoning them back, and then we're doing the boss. Well, I, if there are that many people are going to summon, I'll chill. People are getting in the egg, guys. Sorry about this. This is really awkward. <laughs>
All right, he's running to the quest giver now. So we'll have him back soon. Oh, we lost somebody? Oh, he said invite back, be right back, okay. We are gonna do the boss, boys. It's not a complete loss, but the speed run definitely just got scuffed. Nice, he got the egg. He got the egg, boys. Oh, we gotta go summon someone else, apparently. We didn't summon them initially. I lost the roll. No loot today? I got this offhand. And we slapped the roll off tier. We haven't rolled off any tier yet, so I could win, win tier. I am not zoning out with my world buffs. I am not zoning out with my world buffs. Nope. Damn, we did zoom this raid though. I've only been live an hour and 16 minutes and this boss would be dead by now. So that was, de that was a sub one hour clear. That was a... I'll go ahead and rebuff AIs. Yeah, the Mage Discord has a guide for Frost. No, we didn't have the egg to summon Hakar. Someone had to go turn in the quest. So we had to summon them. We just literally didn't have the fucking egg. It's like the silliest reason.
thought he said Arana was dead. My last crit scroll. I'll have to get more before DMF week. Someone in the guild is saying it is one use, and someone is saying it's multiple use if you completely finish the chain, so not sure. Get my night fin. Mana oil. Um, give Jaku a new AI. Don't need a new arcane elixir. All right, boys. Let's hope I get good RNG. And the debuff never targets me. All right, boys. I'll turn my music back up a little bit. You're going to be... The answer of the lazy player. Yep. The, the lazy player always comes in first. I am blowing it already, boys. I am blowing it already. I have fucked it all up to hell. No pars for me. My first deep freeze proc. I taste the blood of fire. I'm surprised I'm so high up on the damage. I did get the debuff. I don't know if I can ice block it. Maybe I should have tried ice blocking it. Let me see if I can ice block it. Oh, I don't think I'm supposed to actually ice block it, right? I'm definitely fucking this up, boys, but we're doing it. Definitely not a clean pull on I N. Get a deep freeze off. I had so much mana, dude. It's like literally not a problem. It's literally just not a problem at all. You can block it, you can and shoot. Thanks, Brent, Jared. Thanks, Jared, so much. 
Noted. I didn't know what the play was to do there. Appreciate that. Appreciate that a lot. Can and should block it. Understood. Maybe I save cold snap for getting that too. Or just cold slap during execute phase in case um, I do get it twice. I definitely did not handle this parse well, though. If I had a good parse, I'd be surprised. Ice blocked it. Oh, it came back to me. Was that me that almost wiped the raid by ice blocking? There was no way that was me that fucked that up, right? Was that me that fucked that up with the ice block? No, it wasn't me. It was Lamar. Okay, I thought that was me with the ice block that spread it to people. Oh, so it wasn't me. Okay, thank you, Jared. That's what I thought. Okay. Appreciate you, dude. Good to know. We didn't wipe. Two drop? Do I roll need on both? I don't know what I just rolled need on. I probably should have passed. Scapula, is that the, uh... Scapula of the Fallen Avatar. I hope I don't win it, because I don't know if I should have rolled need on it. What does it give? Starts. Oh, it's rings. Alright, let's see what my parcel is for that fight. It's probably not good. Yeah, 88. I mean, 88 for an ult, a close wipe, and most of the raid didn't have world buffs, so... Sure you want it? Ring quest? Oh, it's the... Yeah. I only rolled neat on one of them, so... Two freezing bands is this? Yeah, that's right, Heath. For sure. If you're playing Frost, two freezing bands for sure. Oh, looks like I won one of the rings. Give it back.
Cool. Cool. Alright, we're doing tier now. Three-piece. Is that my tier? Oh, top two so far. Top three. I'm top two. I got I got a tier piece. Oh, I didn't win any of the toys, Rip. I think we're done here, so...
Ugh, this skill takes so long to do loot. I want to go get food. No, Boed's better. I'm gonna get Blade of Eternal Darkness. It's a weak aura. I'm getting it, talk, talk. It's gonna drop, dude. It's gonna drop, dude. That would be nice, David. That would be nice, David.
I don't know what we're doing. We're gonna go get our ring. Nope, I have not gotten a blade yet. Thanks for tuning in to my first Sunken Temple stream, guys. I will play better on the next one. It, it, our raids are every Wednesday, so I will be streaming again next Wednesday for the uh, Sunken Temple raid. Appreciate all you guys tuning into this raid stream. I'm going to call it here. I will be live again tomorrow at 1 p.m. Central Time. I'll be farming Blade of Eternal Darkness, so I'll see you boys tomorrow. Thanks for tuning in, my guys. Thanks for tuning in.